Okay, Proverbs 11.30 in Cognitive Functions. The fruit of the righteous is a tree of life, and he that winneth souls is wise. And uh, in another translation, uh, if the fruit of the righteous is a tree of life, and he who wins souls is wise. So, let's see, pretty much that, I don't know. I'm thinking ENFP, uh, because... Well, INFJ, it was my first thought, so that could be that too. It seems to be occasionally alternating between those two in the last few, at least my perception of what it could be. But, uh, yeah, ENFPs tend to try to change the perspectives of others more, so winning them over on things. This would be before Christ died, of course, so winning their souls isn't meaning like, you know, for that purpose per se, just... And not like, I don't know, I mean, ENTP could sort of be a thing. They also have extrovert intuition as their hero function, but it's also like they tend to disregard the reasoning of others and be parental regarding logic, but um, they, they extrovert more extrovert feeling uh, their third function, which is playful, being playful with the feelings of others. So probably not ENTP so much as ENFP who have extroverted thinking as their third function and introverted thinking as their polar function. So they're always going to be talking out loud pretty much. But, um, well, externally, that's how it would seem anyway. They tend to be the most talkative. But um, even more than ESFJs who have introverted thinking in their uh, first function and their ego functions but yeah I don't know it's almost a coin flip between INFJ and ENFP but I'm thinking slightly more for ENFP being probable for the 30th verse there but 31 looks INFJ for I'll think on it more anyway take care everyone and try not to go crazy <laughs>